leaders, our members of our churches, praise the Lord. We take this opportunity to welcome you to this great occasion of dedicating this land. After we pray, because we have a very short time, I'm going to tell you the short history of the land in a minute, then we will continue. I want to call upon uh, Reverend Matthias to come and pray. <laughs> uh, can you appreciate him? Uh, open with a prayer. We have another Let's pray. Heavenly Father, in Jesus' name, we want to thank you this afternoon for your mercy, for your love, for your goodness. We worship you, our Father. And now, in Jesus' name, in this dedication ceremony, we want to commit ourselves to your program, Holy Spirit of God. Take preeminence and glorify Jesus, even as we do this in the name of Jesus Christ. May your glory be in this place, Lord. We thank you for this is you are doing, oh God. May you receive all the worship, the glory, for this is your very doing, oh Father. Pray the Lord, as you have begun, you are the Alpha, the Omega. Carry this project to the end for the glory and honor of your mighty name. Thank you, Father. We have come here to say, you are our God, our provider. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray and give thanks. Amen. Amen. Can we give a clap to Jesus? Let us allow ourselves one praise song. Then uh, just one which is fiery, we celebrate Jesus because of his doing, and then we will continue from there. Pastors of CCI Kujen and the, you know, the CCI Sultan, sorry. CCI Sultan, sorry. Kujen Yapa. The same as this in the church. Tukiwa na watoto wetu tunakuwa kumi na tisa. Eh, wanasema, wengine wasipoku kuja kutakuwa na ibada. Uh, so tunaweza kuleta ile plate hapa. To unveil kwanza. Unveiling is a, a service. Uh, Tutaalika the two bishops wajembele. And their, the pastors, their spouses. So Bishop unaweza kuino Saidia, Saidiana na Pastor Phyllis Tuna tumuwe Bishop Kutoka tuko kukunenga kola Mitoki Nidetu asele iwe Celebrate him Celebrate him Amen, Amen. Wacha tusomewa na Bishop Yes Christian Church International Sultan Amut To the glory of God this church land was officially dedicated by Bishop John K. Mativo, Secretary General CCI, assisted by Paul, Bishop Paul M. Kiduka, Diocese Bishop of Makueni, on 5th July 2021. Glory, 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 glory,
That one Amen. is done in the name oh. of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Asante, unaweza kuketi. Amen. That is number one. Uh, number two, manake mambo ni machache. Nataka sasa ni mwalike tena, askof kithuka, atusalimie na aseme jambo, kisha amlete bishop mativo, aendele na ibada na atatuambia atatuambia utatukuka saa ngapi ile tu tunaweza sio lazima twende yote lakini kupanda miti ndio itakuwa sehemu ya mtu kupanda miti pale ndio itakuwa sehemu ya mwisho na Damaris na timu yake wako na keki ya 2 minutes ambayo itakatwa tu tukimaliza kuongozwa na askofu Weka mikono yako pamoja tumlete askofu. Ai. We. Gaiju. Eta wangai. Tunashukuru Mungu sana sana. Kwa sababu yeye ni Mungu wa miungiza anatenda makuu anatenda mambo ambayo wakati mwingine atujafikiria na hata kuomba tunaombanga mpaka uh, tunashindwa na kuomba na anaingililia mpaka na penya anaenda bali sana tunashukuru uh, bwana msomba mungu wa mbingu na nchi akumiminie baraka za aina yote mpaka ushangae sio kwako peke yako kwako na jamii pamoja na wajukuu na wote Psalm 112 inasema watu watoto wa yule anayemcha Mungu watakuwa wenye nguvu katika ardhi great and mighty in the land that is your portion nataka msomba wengine wakuje wa, waokoe Kenya hii ya siku za leo kwa sababu ni wachache na tunashindwa watoke wapi wewe eh, sema kitu mpaka wao wakuti kwa sababu you have the anointing we thank god for this occasion thank you bishop matibo uh, for finding time to be with us eh na tena hii ni baada ya kazi zingine na hapa tumeanza tena ibada ingine na wazee wazee wanaanza kuzinzia zinzia huyu mzee ajazinzia ako sawa ako sawa pigia ni yesu makofi hallelujah so he is strong By the way just along the way I want to find the secret I want to know the secret of Bishop Matib He is always strong Years are gone but years find him and go leave him strong Naniminyo ngo ndoma ngo ndoma ngo mudenge nataka si haleluya nisaidie tafadhali kwa sababu ya muda tulete askofu bishop mativo aweze kutudumia aweze kutubariki mikono pamoja katika jina la Yesu karibu 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 askofu bwana wa mbingu akubariki lakini bado kuna haja ya kusoma neno 
Love tutainuka Tutasonga teka tutafika kwa gate Tusunguka love turudi Tumage mahali Mahali hapa First Chronicles chapter number 21 Verse 21. I read. So David came to Onan, and Onan looked and saw David. And they went down from the threshing floor and bowed before David with his face to the ground. 22. Then David said to Onan, Grant me the place of this is threshing floor that I may build an altar on it to the Lord. You shall grant it to me at the full price that the plague may be withdrawn from the people. In Samu, when the mara nyingi ume isoma, when the mara nyingi ume sikia Lakini ebu tu ni nene kwa ufupi. Daudi alijua umuhimu wa madhabao. Sema madhabao. Alijua umuhimu wa madhabao. Na tangu awe mtoto alijua umuhimu wa madhabao na alikuwa najua Mungu na watu ukutanea kwa ma, kwa madhabahu na basi kokawa na shida na Daudi kulalamika hapa na pale alionelea atasimamisha madhabahu ndio amwite Mungu na alijua Mungu akiitwa ataitika na Mungu atalete mabandiliko Reverend Kilenzo alipo ukuja kaniona tukaongea juu ya eh, dedication of this plot. Eh, kwa kili yangu siku wanadhania basi nitayone kiwa vipi. Mwenye kutuwa hii sanda a piece of land. You are blessed. Amen. Watu Kenya wanatafuta plot wanunue. Na mwingine anatoa kiwanja kwa hajili ya madhabahu wengine wakitafuta wanunua wengine basi wakifanya ukora wachukweza wengine mwingine anatoa sandaka ya plot he is blessed pigia yoso makofi mazuri na wadi alijua basi ya kisamaisha madhabahu atatua sandaka ya kuteketezwa na hile ya amani na alijua basi amani itapatikana Daudi ispokuwa eh anaura alitamuka wewe kwa sababu wewe ni mfalme mimi nakupatia bure sandaka bure na kuni bure kila kitu bure Daudi alisema hapana ile bure haitaninguza nataka na mimi ni usike nataka ni usike within that short the short period Angalia spokuwa mwenye sehemu aliitoa sandaka bure within a short time wametoa pesa wakaweka vikingi basi wameweka waya angalia ngeti pale ndio basi eh ata Mungu aachilie baraka zake watu uhusika yeah. Mungu auzi baraka zake Mungu narudea ausi. God does not sell blessings and the miracles to people. But he will release the blessings and the miracles to people when they have done their part. To responsible people. Mtu ata keti tu na aibe wimbo. Mwadi mwadi ai shia mwadi ai nakumbuka mbwa mbani lipata zamani 
eh, sina shida na madhabu lakini missionary mwingine alikuta watu ni kama hawataki kuhusika hawataki kufanya kazi lakini wanataka waambiwe God bless you God bless you Lafu akawafunza ile pambio yake ituma matune chokia sindi lange kila mondo akwa hata zikikatakatwa huko mtu atanosha mkono mwenye kuketi na kukosa kunosha mkono hatapata mwenye hadhi anatoa sandaka reverend close and development committee angalia vile wamefanya na ni maombi yangu basi wasimamishe kanisa kubwa kwa utukufu wa Mungu Baba reverend close kanisa kubwa Don't you just count the 1000 members ama the the, the sub region hata watu wengine watakuwa wakipita wakiona hiyo sign post kubwa wakiona kanisa kubwa kwa sababu Mungu ni mkubwa wanasema why can't we go and then we worship here Amen Bwana Yesu apewe sifa Amen Miaka ya 80 Wenda kuna wale ambao hawakuwa wamezaliwa. Nilipata maono na sio kiburi. Wale ambao mmetembea nami mimi hebu niseme si mtu wa kiburi. Lakini baka na nini 86 wakati wa we, kupima kanisa la CCI blessed of Santa Mumela niliweka 61 feet by the 21 feet na location ya Kaskeo hapa kwa kanisa lingine ambalo nilikuwa nimepita hilo watu wanapita sasa hii hii ni nini hii ni kanisa watu wa kuingia kanisa watatoka wapi saa hii tumejaa tumeanza kutoa pesa tujenge lingine hebu niruhusu tu reverend close peke yake kwa sababu nilimwombea apate upako ambao ninao dumu nao mara tatu ninakuruhusu tu upime moja inipite na ni maandiko kwa sababu Yesu aliambia wanafunzi wake miujiza ambao ninaifanya ninyi mtafanya miujiza ipite wale mengine ambao mnapima 90 na 100 yetu ambao tuna tuna tuna, tuna tumeanza tu, tu kuchanga it will be 105 feet upana ni 40 reverend ndio utakifikisha 120 130 operate just with that open open heaven without a limit wale wengine mkitaka kunifuata ganda the heaven is open Fadamo Mimi niko mbele ambao natengaza hebu nilee watu ambao watapata upako na wanipite kwa sababu wakinipita they are just extending what i do Na sitakuwa na shida itakuwa ni furaha yangu nikiona hivyo This is just but a big vision And it is true that our God is a big Kibwezi is represented by two ministers. Reverend Musoka Dea and Pastor Cosmo Zimutunga. Nile simamo makajana nikatangaza. Mchungaji yeyote ambao kanisa lake liko chini ya 50 by 25 I will never dedicate. Hata akiweka 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 vio vya China the latest na pia akiweka tiles za China if it is less than 50 by 28 I will never dedicate hii ni kumaanisha ni yale ya kuambia watu ambao tunahubiria wana macho wana masikio wana akili wana wanaelewa Isi kanisa za 20 by 12 zinaonesha maono kidogo na Mungu kidogo. 
can live by 18. 12 by 20. Maono kidogo na mungu kidogo. Sasa kuweta asikofu pale and dedicate kandisa ya watu ishirini. Sasa hiyo ni konzati ya inagana. Si ni konzati ya kuchekesha watu. Asikofu ya anaitaji ya itue kwa kandisa ya watu alofu mili. Ndiyo siku ya kudedicate kandisa area chief aje, assistant chief aje, MCA aje, MP aje, matajiri watu waje, wafanyi kazi wa mpengi na ilobi, wakijiji waje, na wapate paki. Sasa yu ya 20 by 12, ata paki ni ya ngota saiko mbili ya kuni. Unajua nilitoka hapa, nikasimama pale It's a big vision Nani mambi yangu basi, eleva ni klonzo Indoto basi itimia Na itatimia na mungu atakuwezesha Basi Daudi alipo pewa Icho kiwanja Ali Yipanga Akasimamisha madabao Sandaka ya kuteketeza na sandaka ya amani Haka mweta mungu na tanui Nilitafuta neno tanui Tanui ni jina lingine la kusema jitu Limunyama ambalo nilakutisha Lina uwa watu Daudi alipo mweta mungu Walimambea mungu Tutete na tupiga nye na uyu tanui Masi madabamba ya tasimamisho hapa Ni ya kumaliza mipango yote ya tanui Mipango yote ya tanui Watu wataokoka Na watu wataponywa Watu watawekwa uru Na watu watabarikiwa Zitaki nilete uwa ujumbe tutu Hebu niseme To dedicate It is to separate Masi hitu meitenga Kujina la baba na mwana na rom dagatifu Lita tumika kwa utukufu wa mwana Lita tumika kwa utukufu wa mwana Na mijengo yote na chochote Kwa utukufu wa mwana Nikiangalia magari hivo So many When you have these black cars Their cost is 100,000 Above these White ones, cream ones Ikiwa ninye uzi Una ungezo of 100,000 Nikizi angalia hivi Na shukuru mungu There are times There were times when you see Many cars and these cars with big engines, there are times if you see them somewhere, it's either a bar or maybe a political gathering. Na mungu amelete mabandiliko. Now many cars are in the church. Many cars are now impacted by men and women who are worshippers. I thank God. I thank God. Basi simama malu lipo. Nona tutenda sana. Pia noni wale kiwe kwa hapa. Itakuja kumaka basi tutufika. Ni hali ya kusema tukika nyanga basi. Tuna miliki. Tuna miliki. Basi pambio moja. We possess. We possess. We possess. We possess. Sifa hizi zote ni zako Sifa hizi zote ni zako Bona sifa hizi zote ni zako Sifa hizi zote Ume tutendea kwa kwa mbutu Sifa hizi zote ni zako
Aleluya, utukufu kwa ko Yesu. Aleluya, utukufu kwa ko Yesu. Utukufu, utukufu kwa ko Yesu. 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 Tumepata nafasi ya kutoka hapa Tukatembea tembea Wana wa Israeli wali Ambiwa wa Kika nyanga pali Basi wana miliki Na kabla tuja keti Tutachukua tu Wakati mfupi Ni mwagilie ii Haldi mafuta Na nikisha mwaga mafuta ni njia moja ya kusema tunakaribisha mbingu kwa sababu mafuta ya kimwagilewa mtu Rom Dagadivu anashuka anahudumia huyo mtu basi na mwaga mafuta nikaribisha ni ni mbingu kwa iki kiwanja ndiyo basi mipangilewa zato ambayo itaendelea hapa mbingu iusike pesa ambazo zita takikana kwa mjengo na mjengo mbingu iusike na vivaa vyote na mafundi wote wapatikane kwa sababu mbingu ikiusika all that which will be needful the kingdom will provide basi niteweka wakfu kumanisha tunaitenga kwa business moja tu ya ufalme nikisha basi magilea mafuta tutabudu ndakika moja and for the future developments nishupo kituka upre kwa sababu hapa pata itajika feather na pata itajika vitu mbali mbali na nina shukuru mungu wa sababu zita patikana na maono atachimia God I dedicate this one in the name of the Father, the Son and of the Spirit basi mungu na weka wanja u wakfu kwa utukufu wako mungu na nikatika jina la baba na mwana na roho mtakatifu saa hii uwanja umetengwa ni kwa utukufu kwa mbingu mbingu usike mbingu itausika mbingu itausika mbingu itausika na roho mtakatifu mbingu usika mbingu usika Mungu usita, tumetenga, tumetenga saa hii Kwa utukufu, kwa mbingu, mbingu itausika Mbingu itausika, tunachukua na fokusta Sana ni asante, mbingu itausika It will be well, mbingu itausika Mbingu itausika, mbingu itausika Kwa mbingu itausika Mungu wetu 
kuna maono na kuna maono ya kutenda kazi yako hapa kujenga ekalu lako Mungu wetu ambalo litaonesha utukufu wako na nguvu na mamlaka yako yataleta sifa kwako kwa hivyo Mungu wetu kwaomba kwamba uwezo wote wa kufanya hiyo kazi utaupeana kwetu katika jina la Yesu Kristo fedha ambazo zaitajika kujenga ekalu kwa utukufu wa jina lako kwaomba Mungu wetu ukazilete katika jina la Yesu Kristo watu wana ujuzi watu wa ambao wana ekima wanaelewa mambo na kutenda kwa ekima Mungu wetu twaomba watu wa kujenga ambao ni maarufu kwa utukufu wa jina lako kwaitaji bwana hata kuja mahala hapa na kuona makuu ambayo utaendelea na kutenda ukileta maono ya vitu vikubwa mijengo mikubwa ya utukufu kwa jina lako baba leta vyote kwa sababu vyote ni vyako na tunaamini kwamba wakati tumeweka na kujenga madhabahu hapa ukiendelea na kushuka utakutana na watu wako na watu wako watabaita watafaidika watajengwa watafanya makuu kwaomba katika jina la Yesu Kristo pasikose chochote chochote ambacho kinahitajika pasiwe na kitu cha kukosekana katika jina la Yesu Kristo mchungaji ukamuinua ukampake mafuta ma, 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 ya, kwa njia ya ajabu akisimama awe na neno kwa ajili ya watu wako ili watu wako wakapate faida na watu wako wakapanuke watu wako wakajengeke watu wako wakapate vitu wakatajirike na wakaleta utajiri kwa nyumba yako katika jina la Yesu Kristo tunakuamini kwa makubwa tunakuamini kwa ujenzi wa ajabu Bwana tuone utukufu wako katika ujenzi tuone kila kitu kikionyesha utukufu wa jina lako Nasema asante kwa kuwa utatenda na tunasema asante kwa maana tunaamini umetenda na tumepokea kwa imani tukishukuru na kutukuza jina lako katika jina la baba la mwana na roho mtakatifu tumeomba na kuamini amen 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 tupigie yesu makofi tunaweza kuketi kidogo tu bishop tumeshukuru sana the two bishops sasa tutachukua tu dakika moja tumwalike pastor Afia That is the joy that we are showing the joy that you are giving to the Lord for such a big blessing and for such a day as today Bwana asifiwe sana We are here to celebrate what the Lord has done This is indeed a very special day in our church in our church calendar and in our church history it will go to records that today marked the beginning of a new place where the church of CCI Sultan Ahmed JC JWC is settling Bwana asifiwe sana I became a bit emotional when bishop declared an open heaven I became a bit emotional because I don't know whether we have understood the the greatness of that pronouncement. Thank you so much. We honor you our bishop who is our chief guest today, Bishop Mativo, assisted by Bishop Kiduka and uh, their spouses, our reverend and mom and all the other visiting ministers who have come to be with us today we celebrate you we thank god for you and we honor you i want to honor all the protocol of the church 
and even our partner to this great ministry, our Major Musomba, who is here with us, Director Christopher Kiamba Memorial Schools, together with the Deputy Director Agnes Katumbi. We recognize your presence and every other person that has come to grace this day. God bless you so much. Let us uh, give thanks so that we can cut the cake very briefly. Jane, want to give thanks. Let us pray together as uh, we move on. Our Father and our God, we thank you. We honor your name. Thank you for this day that you've given it to us. Thank you for giving our eyes to witness the good things that you've done for us and in this ministry. The theme of our year in the church is a year of divine revelation. Behold, our eyes have seen those things that we've never seen before. We have seen Jehovah God, your goodness, in the land of the living. We thank you for such a favor as this that we've bestowed upon the church, that today we step on a new ground to celebrate your goodness. Thank you. We honor you and we worship you as we celebrate the cutting of a cake. We pray that you'll be with us. you sanctify everything that we shall take in this place into our bodies. We honor you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. We have uh, Jane with us who is assisting and our sister that is also going to assist us, Evelyn, in the cutting and in the distribution of a cake to our bishops. When we were told that we are going to be here to celebrate the dedication of this place, we knew that this marks the beginning of a new place where we are settling as a church. And uh, we want to thank God because of what he has already done in this place. For the few months we've witnessed the greatness of the Lord and the miracles, those things that we have declared in the theme as a church we have already witnessed and we want to say that uh, that theme was released uh, by the servants of God when they were led by the Spirit of God. One as if you were son. And so we are here to mark the beginning of this uh, ministry here, the, the relocating and the starting of the ministry here. We are reading what has already been written in the cake I want Jen, you just lift it up that the bishop may see it and the, and the pastors that have come to witness. Buru, I hope you're taking this photo, it's very important. We have a clarion call that we are saying the ark must settle. We are reading from the book of 1 Chronicles chapter 17 verse 1. May the Lord be praised. Praise the name of the Lord. Um, the words in this book were, were said by David. And he was um, talking to the man of God, the prophet, Nathan. And he said now that he has his own house, built of cedar, he is not contented that the ark is not settled at the right place. And he desired to build a house for the Lord where the ark can settle. And in verse 2, the prophet of God, Nathan, tells him, what you have desired to do in your heart, do it. Those are the words that I want to lay emphasis on this day. Reverend and mom, Bishop, who is a prophet today, a studier, and he declared that the heaven is open for you. Whatever you want to do, we want to stress those words in verse 2 of First Chronicles 17. That uh, whatever your heart has desired, just do it. Because the Lord is with you. So we thank you, man of God, our bishop, for coming to prophesy those words. That the heaven is open for us as a church. And we must move on, CCI Sultan Amod because the heaven is open and whatever the Lord has guided his servant to do, he will do it because the Lord is with him. One as if he was son. We will call our chief guest, our bishop, 
uh, Mativo, with all honor and respect, I'm calling upon you just to come. Shangu is wapi? Judy, you are here for this mission. More celebration as our bishop comes. I'll also request our bishop, Makueni Diocese, Bishop Paul Kiduka, kindly come to the front. Our moms are also coming to witness by their sides. Great ladies, a clap to these great ladies kindly so that we move fast. Let's move faster. Reverend and mom, kindly stand up. Let them have their hands washed very fast. As Reverend washes his hands. Cakes are cut when people are celebrating their best in life. Today marks our best as a church in this particular place. So we will cut this cake to tell God thank you for enabling us to reach this level because we have been told this just the beginning. We will scale many other levels, God enabling us. So today we will cut this cake to celebrate that. I will um, request our bishop, Reverend, I don't know how. If Reverend can be right at the center, you are the one who is being prophesied to do as your heart desires to stand right at the center. The prophets of God are here. Whatever you want to whisper to the man of God to do, just whisper, he's listening. There they are, they are cutting the cake. We are celebrating, we are celebrating. We are celebrating the Lord's doing. Thank you God, we celebrate you, we thank you. We honor your name. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Just once. Amen. Our bishop has said, let that be dream come to fulfillment. That is a pronouncement. Deputy Director Katumbi, Agnes, kindly bring that here. We will uh, request um, our moms to feed our bishops. Mm. 
Uru capture that photo, the photo over here. There they are. There they are. They have declared, let this big dream be fulfilled. Amen. Amen. We can also feed our moms. Sweet 16 is smiling. Yes, mom. Yes. We thank God. Mom and Reverend. Reverend Kwaish Mazote Tafadali give uh, our director retired Major Musova cake. Celebrate him. Celebrate, celebrate, celebrate. I'll request our mom, Pastor Damaris, to feed Katumbi. Uh, yes, yes. Yes. Thank you so much.
From the moment that I wake up Until I lay my head Oh, I will see Of the goodness of God The goodness of God. Oh.